Hi, Christopher Power here. Empower Yourself is, ex is a nine-week experiential interaction, I will call it. An interaction, a program where I work with you to take you to the next level of your, your life, from wherever you are now to the next level, no matter how successful, no matter how at the beginning you are or in the middle. We work for nine weeks together to make sure that you empower yourself. I can't do that. You have to do that yourself. But I can provide the support and the nurturing and the insight and the inspiration, even the boundary setting, to make sure that you tap into your power, really light up, bring your unique gifts to the table and then apply them to whatever it is you want so that you're fulfilled and everyone that you're in contact with is inspired and motivated by the sheer joy and creativity of your presence. Now, why I'm talking about that now is that this these months, these next three months are the perfect time in history to do something like this. I'm talking about late July here. Um, it's two days after the new moon in Leo in late July, 29th, 30th of July, depending on where you are in the world. August, September and October. These are an incredibly unique period of time, series of months in the history of this world. There's the Leo new moon. Now, up until now, I've kept astrology fairly low key because I'm working with professional business people, sports people, um, everything from farmers to really practical people to healers to people who don't mind alternative stuff or really believe in it, the whole spectrum. But I don't want to give you the impression that this is going to be about all the skills and all the things and, that I've learned over 50 years. I'm going to use those, but we're not. it's not about, look what I've learned and you can learn it too. It's much more about, I've learned all these unique skills and insights and they can really be used in a customised way to help you find your unique gifts and talents, really nurture them, plug them into your power, the source of power within you, and that will empower you to bring your best to your life and to the table, to those that you share your life with. Now, because of that, because of what's happening astrologically, I really want to bring that in now. And I want to make it clear that astrology, in my circumstances as a trained scientist, is not this woo-woo thing or this thing that I use to gain attention or to impress people with or even to help people with because they need it. No, it's a very powerful tool to tune you in to what is going in on in the environment. Now, to make this clear for those of you who go, ah, you know, imagine if you took the sun out of the solar system. Now, the solar system would totally break down gravitationally, orbitally, but it wouldn't matter because within 18 hours, this planet would be frozen solid. So within 24 hours, all life would be wiped out on this earth, including you. If the moon was somehow taken out, what would happen is the circulation of fluids on this planet, whether it's the ocean currents or the circulation of your blood or the sap in the trees, all of those would be massively affected, as well as the way the earth um, 
orbits and rotates. So that would have a massive effect on you, on your bloodstream, on food, on the climate, the whole thing. So when you look at that, even from a scientific point of view, it's obvious that the sun, the moon, the planets all have a very powerful effect on what happens on Earth, on the energy of the solar system, and ultimately on you. So for thousands of years, new moons, full moons were always considered special times in many, many cultures for the obvious reasons. And this new moon in Leo really focuses on you shining, on your creativity, on, on living your life gracefully. Because gracefully means to do what comes naturally to you. That's when it's graceful, when you're doing what comes naturally to you. And you light up and you shine. So that's one thing that's happening uh, end of July into August is the opportunities there for everyone to, to really light up, to be more creative, to develop more confidence and to do what you do naturally. So that energy is there. Yeah, look, I surfed for 25 years and one thing we learned from surfing was there's no point going surfing if the swell isn't up, if there's no swell. And when I look at my history as a, as a person, I've always had this tendency to turn up in places just before a new swell hits. I turn up and things change after it. I can go through dozens of examples of this. I tend to be a catalyst in some form or like a weather person. You know, I read the charts and I tell people, what's what's coming but i don't do it intellectually or even necessarily through astrology i just happen to have that sort of synchronicity and timing that when i turn up things are about to change now in your life it's a decision you need to make because if i turn up things can really change but you need to decide are you ready for that or not So coming back to this change that I'm talking about at the moment, at the same time as the new moon, you have Uranus, Mars and the North Node all conjunct in the same place in Taurus. Now, this hasn't happened for 2,500 years since Alexander the Great was around. So it's a once-in-a-lifetime event. And the North Node represents our future. Uranus represents the consciousness and tuning in to the future through technology, through being more conscious, through working together more effectively as human beings by really being innovative if it's in business or in sport real innovation. It's not rate rampant idealism. It's innovation that really helps you and humanity true tune into each other and take a step forward into the future, into the unknown in a very positive way. And then Mars is what I like to call Nike consciousness. You just do it. So the impact of that is happening right now at the end of July. It's going to ripple right through August, September, even into October. So it's time to move forward. And similarly, Mars is in Aquarius. Sorry, uh, Saturn is in Aquarius. It's been at 90 degrees to Uranus for two years now. And they're both lining up for their last interaction. It's like there's been four waves of preparation. And now this is the last wave where you balance st 
structured, meaningful, disciplined consciousness and humanity and humanity being pragmatic as well as very conscious. And you marry that with innovation that really brings value to the physical world, that really works in real life, that adds value to your life. And that's what's so fascinating about this. And there's a couple of other things going on is there's never been a time like this for you and the people we know to make such a big breakthrough. Now, to move into the future with our feet on the ground and our ideals conscious enough that they actually add value to the world rather than end up destroying or you know, benefiting a few at the cost of millions and hundreds of millions of people's lives. We've seen that happen in the last century. I was alive when that was going on. So now's the time, to put it simply, to bring your very best to the table. And it's an opportunity for you to go to the next level, as I said, no matter how successful you are, there's always more. And because this is going to be done in a context where we handle survival, we're not going to dismiss it. We're not going to try and contact, conquer survival. We're going to deal with it so it's handled. Because then love is the bottom line. And I'm talking about authentic love, not fantasy or excessive romanticism. I'm talking about real, down-to-earth, practical love. Love that's both beyond this world and within this world, working together. And that's the context in which we'll work together. And it only struck me two days ago that this, you know, I'd created this program already, Empower Yourself. And the timing couldn't have been better. It took me three or four weeks to wait to realise that. But again, that's me being the catalyst. So what I'm offering to you is the opportunity to go for it in your life with my support and help. 50 years you know, I'm 73 now for at least 50 years. I've been working on all this alternative, conservative, practical, the whole thing, all blended together beautifully, working with the best of the best. I've been blessed. And I've used it to have a great life, not one that gains attention, but one that I can respect. And I've learned to respect those who truly are loyal to themselves, whether that's been outrageously successful as a public figure or very quietly behind the scenes doing their thing or even really simple people. And I know my family are Thai. They live in rural Thailand. And they've changed my life. Some of the people there, people will never, ever hear of, but they're profoundly real, genuine, generous, aware. And one little autistic girl, she just shines. She doesn't even know <laughs> she does. But when you're in her presence, it's magnificent. Well, all of us have that. There is that exceptional part of us. And this is what empowering yourself focuses on. So it's nine weeks of working with me intensively, a couple of hours a week. And then there's going to be things that you're working on in your business, in your sport, in your personal growth and development, in your family, you know, wherever it is that you find true meaning. And so that you bring out these gifts that are unique to you. A person who's never existed before in 4.3 billion years of Earth's history and will never exist again in the future. 
This is a time for you, when I say empower yourself, to plug in to the source of power within you. Imagine you were an air conditioner or a refrigerator. You could be the best one ever invented in the world, but if you're not plugged into the socket, to the power source, you'll never realise your potential. Well, that's what you do with empowering yourself. You plug into your source of power. And that's something I know a lot about. And I can help you do it yourself. I'm not going to give it to you. I can't. But I can help you discover very clearly how to do that, how it works for you, what it's going to switch on, how to bring that out elegantly so it's not a struggle. Because that handles your survival issues. In fact, 40 to 50% of us in the world have survival handled. We just keep raising the bar so high. We think we, we're not going to survive unless we have millions, tens of millions. Well, it's not true. Most of us are ready to shine. But we need to get in touch with authentically loving ourselves, plugging ourselves into power and bringing that to the table in ways that you have no reservations about. Or you can be confident and proud in yourself. Or even if you do have reservations, you're willing to risk it, right? You're willing to put it out there and then discover the people that you truly can work with to make all our lives better. Their lives, your life, the people that you love, so that your presence in this world makes a real difference because you're just who you are. So you want to get involved with this? Contact me. Below here, I'm going to have a couple of very simple things. This is not a super sophisticated, you know, <coughs> marketing trip. With I'm going to give you my email, my WhatsApp number, either of those. Contact me or reply to this uh, wherever you see it, post on social media or in an email. Reply to me. And then we'll discuss whether this is a real match for you. Now, it's for people who are really committed. It's not cheap. So be aware of that. It's 4,500 US dollars for the nine weeks. That's an investment. And you need to be ready and willing and able to make that investment. But in that nine weeks, there's going to be a much bigger investment that I'm going to both demand of you and encourage you. And that is the courage to go to the next level at your life, to embrace your unique gifts and talents and not compromise them in order just to get along or fit in. I'm going to ask you to find the most elegant, easy way to do that. And we're going to look for that and nail that together. So the real investment is going to be your energy, the power that you put in. You need to plug into that power, turn on and, and go for it. Just do it. You know, Uranus, North Node and Mars, just do it. It's not for those who are interested or want to get a buzz. It's for those who want to live their life rich and full. And my job is to help you to the very best of my ability to realise that. And the swell is running at the moment. The energy is there at the moment to support us doing it. So the timing is right. So choices in your court. I would love, as they used to say in the 
60s, I'd love to turn you on. Well, I'd love to support you turning yourself on and bringing the very best of who you are to the table. So let that, what I've said, impact your body. Let it, feel it. Don't just think about it, feel it. And if, if you're ready for this, because the timing is right, if you're willing to do it, then contact me. It's your decision and we'll discuss it to make sure it's a proper fit. But now it's up to you. Go for it. I'll talk to you again later.